live. We're live streaming. We're live streaming RimWorld. Let me just adjust some things. Don't need this open. Don't need that open at all. And there we are. I think that's it. Uh, I just should check if that's working. <laughs> this is the, the faffing about at the start of the stream. Am I streaming? I think I'm streaming. My YouTube channel. How do you even know when someone's streaming on YouTube? I just do it. I don't know how people find it. Uh, I can't find it. You know what? It's fine. I'm probably streaming. I'll wait for someone to show up and tell me. <laughs> Which they usually do. Uh, live now. Okay. So, that should be hopefully working. We'll find out. We'll find out when people are unable to view it. Uh, so, we're playing RimWorld. This... <laughs> Everything's fine. We've we've got the new DLC. I just bought it, just specially for this stream. I hope you're all grateful and click on lots of ads. Thank you. I'm glad I'm streaming. The stream's a little later than I meant to start. I didn't have a specified start time, but I was about to sit down and start streaming, and then my gums just started bleeding massively, so that was very inconvenient, and I had to resolve that. <laughs> but it's fine. I'm fine. My mouth hurts. We're gonna play RimWorld. <laughs> I don't need that for streaming, right? I'm gonna start a new colony. We've got this exciting, exciting nobility situation. Maybe we'll go for a classic start. Quiet. I can fix that. And there. That should be a little noisier. I might have overdone it now. You might regret that. Uh, yeah, we might go for crash landed because it's just classic, isn't it? It's just, it's. It's a nice medium start for a nice, happy game of <laughs> RimWorld. Uh, we will go for Cassandra Classic Medium. I'm not that good at this game. I think we can change this later. Uh, yeah, I haven't played that much RimWorld, so I don't feel super confident on the, the higher difficulties. Does this happen often? No, it happened uh, right after the lockdown. And obviously because of the lockdown, uh, I'm unable to get a dentist appointment. It's not bad enough to be like an emergency appointment, but I would really like to see a dentist, but I can't. Um, we'll choose, we'll choose commitment. That seems fine. Randomized seed, bow tie, and we're going to be playing with, it's just some stuff, whatever, default is fine. Uh, and we will have all of, we have all the content. That's very exciting. Not too much slow building up either. Slow building up me? Ooh, what's this? What are you? Is that nobles? I think that's nobility. Well, we want to be near whatever these column things are because they seem really exciting. This one here is in a not too inconvenient place. Uh, We can't see what factions are friendly to us, I guess. Oh no, this is this is their friendliness to us. So purple, yellow, and the Shattered Empire. Uh, so this would be like a really friendly spot. <laughs> I don't know, I don't want to die too much too early in the stream. Ah, uh, well, thank you for stopping by, Rico G. Wacko. Thank you. Yeah, Crash Landed. I d the Tribes People one is just a really slow start. I want to get into the game, start doing things for the entertainment of us all. Uh, hmm. Maybe we'll go here-ish. Somewhere around here. We'll get... I don't know if I want full mountains. Um, maybe more on this main road. Because this asphalt road we can travel pretty fast on. Few settlements nearby. This thing, I don't know what that is, but that's exciting. So we'll be here. Next to the road. Tropical rainforest. Or we go on the river? I don't really know what you can do with rivers, but uh, they seem to just inconveniently block off a large portion of the map. So we'll go here. And we will stop. Okay. Now it's how long do we spend randomizing to get good people? Well, I don't want health conditions. 
I'm not sure I want a pyromaniac. <laughs> Incapable of firefighting. Well, that makes sense. Uh, two VR designers. Yeah. We will do names after people in chat, so that's fun. So we can choose three. We want something like, we do want a doctor, probably. We, uh, we need all the skills. Okay, we're just going to hit randomize a little bit. <laughs> uh, you're an artist. We don't need an artist. Mining intellectual. You're not very good, but you're passionate. Nah. Nah. Passionate about plants. Really good at animals, but you've got a lot of issues. <laughs> Prosthetic heart. I mean, that's not too bad. You're like a good all-rounder. Yeah, I don't know how picky to be. Crafting is nice. We need someone with plants. Do any of you have plants? You have plants. You have an ambrosia addiction. And... Oh, rivers are useful now. Bloop. Okay. <laughs> Did I get rid of them all? Do I still have them? I still have them. Okay. Uh... Plants, I don't think I want to deal with the whole body ambrosia addiction. That's a pain in the butt. I've done that before. <laughs> and it's very annoying. You seem pretty good. Why don't you join us? Psychically sensitive is... Oh, you hate men and women. Super excited to have you on the team. Thanks. Psychically sensitive. So that's good. Okay, they can be my psychic noble. This person could be our noble. This, yeah. We'll have this lady be our nobility. She's got a good hairstyle. She's social and uh, she's psychically sensitive. So, oh, she's forsaken physical comforts, which is like, it's, it's not very noble aesthetic, but it probably makes her quite a convenient noble because I imagine they're quite demanding. Uh, so... You would be our chef. I think I want someone who can shoot. Uh, this is a good, like, jack of all trades character. Body purist. That's fine. Construction. We don't have anyone who's really good at shooting. Oh! But you're so... You're so versatile. Okay, we're gonna have this person. Uh, because they're super versatile. Great. I don't know if I want a misogynist misandrist. That's quite a lot. But you're really good at construction. Well, you know what? I don't want to spend forever randomizing these. So let's name these. Uh, the nobility. Who wants to? Be Dorkling. We're doing this. We did this stream for you, Dorkling. You can be the nobility. And have. She's going to hate being a noble. Oh, spoilers. Spoilers, please. Uh, Seraphix, you can be this really useful person. Because, I don't know, unless you, you hate everyone, let me know. If you hate everyone, we can switch you to be this person that hates everyone. I think I have to keep the misogynist misandrist because that's just such a good combination of traits. Let's go for it. Dorkling's going to love being a noble. <laughs> Trust me, it's going to be fine. Oh, I can't cut loading screens out of live streams because they're live. You can't just cut stuff out. <laughs> okay, uh, we are awake in our sarcophagi and we land on the world. What a terrible decision. Okay, let's take a pause and think about life. First, I'm going to claim the things that are ours. Okay. Okay. Give, give the, okay. Who's our main melee person? <laughs> uh, you, sucker fighting, Dorkling, you're fine. Where's Seraphix? Seraphix hasn't landed yet. There we go. Seraphix brought the silver and a hat. So, you're good at... You're the best at shooting. None of you are particularly good. So we'll give... Oh, Dorkling, you have such good hair. That must be new. That must be new. 
<laughs> gonna do my hair like that in real life. You know what? We'll distribute the armor equally. You, everyone gets a piece of armor. That's fair. And you can just have a knife. Okay, beautiful. So let's take a look at the map. Gulliver is a brilliant, brilliant uh, name for a horse, indeed. Uh, so, what is this? What is that? A thick slab memorializes important events. Something important happened here with marble columns and things. Okay, that's fun. That's a bit of archaeology that we're going to ignore, probably. Uh, so I guess we want to be near the river if we can, if water mills are a thing. But I don't think I want to be too near the river because it would probably be in basic architecture. I don't think we can structure our way across the river very securely for a base. I quite like the middle of the map. I have a preference for the middle of the map because then you have maximum time for things approaching from all directions. Maybe we restore this like marble place. There was a nice building here once. We could we could kind of renovate this a bit and move in. It's got a steam geyser next to it. Rich soil. That's rich soil. That's rich soil. I get it confused with mud and marsh. So let's move into this building and we'll make some decisions. Uh, you can all chime in yourselves with whether or not we want to do uh, like an outdoorsy colony or an indoorsy colony, if you know what I mean. Because we could build a colony that's all outside um like outside buildings that are connected up so like we have this building and then we'll have a separate building over here and then we'll put a fence around the whole thing or we could have it all as one building which i haven't really done that much of so maybe that would be more fun because that'd be like fresh oh i should queue up more things uh so <laughs> we want uh stockpile zone probably in here like that and that will be a nice little everything pile yeah it's good we're gonna want a door on this building if we claim it for ourselves which we are and we'll want probably to start farming because I have a bad habit with uh... <laughs> it is a nice throne room Good evening, welcome. Uh, we're gonna try and have a moderately successful colony for a little while at least. <laughs> Which I know, it's not very me, but it's nice to do different things, like not die horribly sometimes. Okay, corn will take a long time, but is most efficient. And then I'll make like another pile over here. Then we want, yeah, we can just, potatoes are fine. Yeah, we'll just potatoes. And I don't know like if food variety actually helps that much, but I just feel like it does. <laughs> to me, to me it helps. Like strawberries are delicious. Of course we should have strawberries. You all deserve strawberries once we get skilled enough to plant them anyway. Okay, uh, so we'll just, I can't be bothered to do these things. The person with the most passion should do it. That's the long-term investment. Uh, okay, things are happening. Good, Gulliver, I'm gonna teach you hauling first. Seraphix is gonna teach you hauling. Nothing but strawberries. Oh, potatoes are just less efficient. Okay, we're not doing potatoes then. Why would I do that? Uh, we will do corn. I want to keep the rice though. I know corn's most efficient, but rice uh, grows faster. Corn takes ages to grow. And I don't need people starving to death right now. So you know what? I'm going to replace that with a door because going to become a door later. We'll just expand the building. 
So we've got a nice entrance hall dining room, I guess. It can be a kind of dining room. Um, there's a lot of random stuff in here. Steel urns. That's fine. Let's just try and get this all blocked in. Patched up with wood. And I think it's a zone thing? Home area? Yeah, this counts as home area. So they will do repairs, hopefully. Horses could... I didn't realise horses could haul. I don't know how they pick things up. I guess they carry it in their mouths. That's cute. <gasps> what are you? Oh my gosh, it's so cute. Look at it. Okay, let's hunt it. Because I bet it won't fight back. <laughs> uh, so we'll need to set up a... I think this entrance room will eventually become a kind of dining room area. Uh, like This will be like a big workshop crafty type room. Oh, I got spooked by the sound of the, the murdering that I ordered. So we'll roof all of this. Can't build roof over a tree. That's okay, you can get rid of the tree. It's okay, you can get rid of the tree. It's allowed. It's fine. He's a good horse. Uh, so yeah, we need, this will be like a big communal workshop, like living room, I guess. And we'll build, we always want a nice big fridge freezer <laughs> to keep things in. So I might as well go ahead and put it up against this rock. I need to make it reasonably big. What are you? Are you bad soil? marsh no i can't build stuff on that can i i probably can bridge over it yeah it'll be fine it'll be fine we'll go over it so nice big fridge freezer and we'll build a little airlock room into it littler airlock room into it. This is the fun bit. <laughs> I enjoy this part of the game a lot. Uh, cancel these wooden doors here. Nice. Oh, connection lost. Oh, um, I did warn that my internet is not entirely reliable. But hopefully it'll be okay. I believe. <laughs> I believe. That's all I need, right? Is belief. I'm pretty sure. Uh, claim. So is that a mass claim order? Yes. These are ours. We found them. They're ours. You can repair them if you want. And we will chop wood. Just clear out the front of the base, really. This is nice, this is grand. Uh, wood walls are okay, but not heavy walls. So because it'll be in the middle of the base, I think what I've tried to do before and not got that far with is build the inside of the base out of wood because it's really cheap and then wrap the outside in stone because stone is like a bit of a pain to make but makes it quite secure. So we'll do, we'll aim for something like that. Let's get some sleeping spots. Not ideal, but you know. <laughs> They'll get over it. It'll be fine. Ooh, drapes! <laughs> Amazing! Okay. Grand throne. Oh, we've got all sorts. This is gonna make a great noble room one day. Wood inside, stone outside. Yeah, because I think double thickness walls seem to deter invaders, and then they should go down. We'll probably build a kill corridor. I don't know if it'll be here because we've got this nice farming area. I might wall the farming area and then build a kill corridor off of that. I don't know. It'll be a courtyard. It's a civilized... Oh, we could go for a kind of courtyard design. I've already started building this. If I was going to do a courtyard design, I should have decided that earlier, really. Hmm. <laughs> okay, it's fine. 
we we will build this the food stuff here and then maybe when we build bedrooms we'll make a courtyard but maybe not because i've left it i've started building oh, if i stop this now then it could it could still no it's fine it's because i've been playing prison architect that's i bet that's it it's all about build when am i gonna build your throne when when you've become a, a noble you're a janitor at the moment look i've i'm ready to support you in your bid for nobility but you've got to earn it dorkling you've got to earn it okay our people are very busy oh you've killed it ha, -ha. <laughs> we we don't have any capability to process it but that's okay Let's make a butcher table. Whoops. Uh, this is how you rotate. I have not put enough space in here, have I? Nope. Nope, I haven't. Okay, uh, time for a rapid redesign of this corner. Uh, we'll do this this and this cancel this and we'll, we'll make this long like that that's fine yeah you you're aesthetic it's fine human leather throne can you not what outrageous uninstall zero out of ten uh grand throne gold and steel yeah no human leather Disappointing. Provide you with a squalid hole. Don't you worry. Bedrooms are on the way. Oh, you, you're inspired. You're going to recruit the next prisoner. What, what's the game telling me here? <laughs> I don't think I like what the game's telling me. Okay. Uh, so, just keep designating things, really. There's a lot to be done. We will want, now that this is enclosed ish, we'll put the food there. And this will be, I probably haven't made this big enough, but we'll prefer this for food. Non-rotten food. Okay. Oh, and you know what? Have I left room for a table now? I have, yes. Okay, good. Good, everything's fine. Uh, what do we have for electricity? Just, oh, we have wooden turbines. Not wooden turbines, wind turbines. They are not made of wood. Uh, I will put that. I don't think you need to leave this back area of it clear so we could put it here with the fields. I've heard that that is a clever thing to do. Maybe. Yes, we don't have enough components. We can get components. There's components here. There. Okay, which means we will be building a electric stove. It's it's not going to be outdoors for long. It's fine. And we'll get a wooden research bench in our nebulous, like, crafty area, I guess. I think that's what this is. And yeah, this is a good start. Continue at your leisure, colonists. Don't both sides need to be unobstructed? Uh, you know what? That sounds true. <laughs> Is there a prevailing wind direction in this game? I'm just going to assume not and build it here. It's nice to have the fields around it because that keeps it clear from what I understand. The water mill. Yes. Wood fire generator may be better. Okay, good point. <laughs> good point, well made. We'll just do a wood fire generator. It'll be fine. We'll just put it in the corner. Actually, we want it... Yeah, we'll put it over here. Somewhere. I don't know. I don't care. Just put it there. Move on. And we need to run them through walls. 
kind of a little, a little gap there. That's fine. Beautiful! We have finished the thing! Amazing. Okay, uh, so we want temperature cooler. Cold on this side, warm on this side. That's fine. I don't think that's a defensive problem because the whole base is made out of wood for the moment. So everything's a defensive problem. Oh, I'm not looking forward to our first pirates. Maybe I should build the kill box now for when we get our first first batch of attackers. Because there's a lot of cover with all these trees. I don't really like it. Okay, is everyone working hard? Because as long as everyone's working hard, I don't need to... Darkling, are you sparkling? No, that's just that's just the animation. Uh, which storyteller... We are, we are on uh, medium... The blandest setting. Cassandra Classic and like a medium difficulty because I'm not very good at this game. And I don't want to die before the stream's over. That seems excessive. It's, it's nice to have the option to continue things. <laughs> oh, I can't go through there. Hmm. You know what? We're going to deconstruct that because we don't need it. Like this, this. I don't know how far they reach, but we'll need this anyway. We'll need wires everywhere. Are we constructing a lava cult here as well? We are always constructing a lava cult. There isn't lava in this game though, so as far as I know, there might be in this new version, uh, but that might make things a little difficult. So. Bedrooms are probably next on the agenda because they make people happy and happy people are compliant. So I think maybe if we have like production sort of things down here and living things, not like living creatures, living things like uh, living quarters and such like up. Oh, look at me building two wide corridors like I'm fancy. What am I doing? Uh, right, let's pause. So we'll have nice big bedrooms seem to be like an easy way to, okay, that's excessive. <laughs> Not that much. Like that, but less. Seem to be a nice cheap way to keep people a bit happy. Don't know, might be making that up. Uh, this'll be a nice bedroom. Uh, this is a bit of a weird room, actually. Okay, that's not going to be a bedroom. I don't even... I don't know what size I'm making these. <laughs> How big are you? Five. How big are you? Five. Okay, that's fine. And you're five this way. Five by five. That's not what I've done here. Oh, dear. It's going to be one of those streams, everyone. <laughs> I'm not... Not entirely with it, but that's okay. You'll all forgive me, I'm sure. So we'll put a wooden door in here. This will be a something room. And we'll have this. These be bedrooms. Three bedrooms. We will need more bedrooms very soon, but that's sufficient for now. You don't, you don't have to be here for the gameplay. It's okay. It's okay to admit that. <laughs> Excellent idea to get Seraphix killed. Everything I do is an excellent idea to get Seraphix killed with their knife. Maybe they can reconstruct your face. I I don't think there's anything that can fix that. I don't think traits, you can't like prosthetic your way past traits. You're steadfast and kind. It's and we can we you have a hat, right? Oh no, you don't have the hat. Okay. Maybe we should have given you the hat. We'll work on hats. We will unlock hats and we will give them to you because you need them. Let's pause the game because I need to look at research and there's a lot happening. Uh, beer brewing, obviously important. Hmm. Noble apparel, harp. Okay, I'm gonna, that's cool and interesting. I'm going up here and I'm going to work on some of these things. 
So, what do we want? Uh, water mill generator. I see. Seems very hard to defend. I think we probably just want geothermal. They're expensive. We can afford it. It's fine. Let's get geothermal. Because we have this geothermal right here. Octagonal bedrooms. Yeah, but you don't want fancy Dorkling. <laughs> Look at you. You don't even you don't even want anything fancy. You never judge others by their appearance, so you probably get on really well with Seraphix. Visitors. I don't think we're gonna eat the visitors, though it is tempting. Okay, let's architect ourselves some bedrooms here. We need. Let's make double beds because we might as well. Uh, there. And we'll get dresses because they make things better. Like that. And we will grab plant pots because they are cheap and cheerful. Which is how we want our colonists to be. Cheap and cheerful. We don't have anything in the stockpile because we don't own anything. So that's great. I think they're starting to repair the walls, but repairing marble walls is like a big job. So they're not... Ooh, a quest! The frightened... I don't... I don't know. I don't know what how to pronounce that, but I think it's like a Roman title thing. View the quest. Uh, a praetor of the Red Empire is calling from nearby. He's being followed by an angry squirrel. Oh, a deadly threat. Keep him safe for a few hours. Eight royal favor on whoever accepts this quest. Oh. Okay, Dorkling, I have a quest for you. On your road to nobility. So we need to keep you safe for a few hours. So we're gonna... Uh, I think we'll draft you and put you inside. What is that? Psychic entropy. Blinding pulse. So are you gonna be chased onto the map by an angry squirrel? Apparently not. I also really feel like you could take out an angry squirrel. Oh, there it is. Where is it? It's a highly motivated angry squirrel. What a first test. <laughs> Pre-door. Yeah. Uh, I figured it was a Roman thing. <laughs> it sounds correct. I feel like you could really take this out. Slow it down. You've got some crazy psychic powers. Um... So we're gonna bring you here and Dorkling, you've got a gun. So I'm gonna bring you up here. You've got a knife. Okay, you're maybe not needed. You've got a gun. We'll put them both here. I think we'll just get this guy inside because we don't want to injure him, even though he's got really cool powers that would probably work very well. And we're gonna set up butchering just as an aside because I've realized that we can do that. Welcome to the colony. Um, I hope you're faster than the angry, angry squirrel. Where's the squirrel? Uh-oh. I've lost it. <laughs> I should have kept the pop-up. Uh, if an elephant went manhunter, went manhunter and decapitated it, I would love that. That would be great. I can't believe this guy couldn't... He's got all these crazy psychic powers, and yet... Where's the squirrel? Uh... There it is. Okay. All right, team. Amazing work. <laughs> You're free. You're free. Do what you want. Oh, he's building a roof. He's helping us out. Nice. Good work. And we can butcher that squirrel and eat it. I didn't expect him, I guess he's just, yeah, he's just fully joined as a colonist, so it makes sense, but it's really nice of him to help us out for a while. Do you want to just stay? I guess that's not an option. Shuttle leaving. Where's the shuttle? There's the shuttle. Oh, that's so cute. 
Oh my god, can we get a cuddle? A, a, a shuttle? A cuddle shuttle? Yeah, I know, it was pretty intense. It was pretty aggressive. Um, but we are a brave, strong people. And we were able to defeat it. Okay, goodbye. No recreation. Recreation. Recreation! We will build a horseshoe pin. The best form of recreation. I'm going to put it in the middle of the fields because then it can be accessed from all directions. Is that a good idea? Eh, yeah, that's fine. <laughs> that was very intense everyone but I hope you're proud of our first quest. Dorkling's gonna get titles! It's gonna be great! Let's see how haughty you get, Dorkling. Okay, we'll deconstruct these. Minor break risk. This guy. Well, you need to leave on the shuttle. Oh, right. I need to tell you. Get in the shuttle. Get out of here. Thanks for the help. <laughs> Much appreciated. Uh, you've been very useful. But you can leave now because I don't want the stress of you staying. Goodbye. <laughs> We've done our quest. Dorkling's getting a title. And we're going to raise you up. The psychically sensitive Dorkling. Okay, so I think we've got a lot of essential rooms built. We need some kind of dining room. Starvation. You're leaving. Go. We did it! <laughs> Okay, quest completed. We did it. Close. Title rewards. Dorkling has got a psychic amplifier. Dorkling has got the Yeoman title from the Red Empire. So you get a implant. Oh, and you've got an heir. Nice. And you've got a freeholder title. And you've got an heir. Cool. Oh, you know what? We should we should name uh, this this guy. Needs a name. You're gonna be uh, someone in chat. <laughs> Heyman. Hey, Heyman. Yes. Welcome. You are still an escaped convict, but you know I can't fix that for you. <laughs> that's just how you are, and that's okay. We forgive you. Alright, uh, we don't have a lot in the stockpile. Uh, people have mostly repaired the marble walls. Hello, Bobcat! Welcome. Sorry, I didn't welcome you. But that's a great line about squirrels being like cigarettes. Reconvict them. I mean, this is kind of like a prison camp, isn't it? <laughs> you work all day. Just play horseshoes, that's all you can do. Ah, okay, psychic amplifier. Dorkling, I have a treat for you. Put that in your brain. What is this? So you get entropy when you do psychic things. Pain makes you focus. You're in pain. Oh, you have a bite scar. Oh, that's perfect! That's even better! Congratulations. <laughs> uh, so, what do we want to build next? We've got research selected. Someone is... People are assigned to do it once everything else is done. Uh, we could start on building stone. I probably want stone for the kill corridor, so that wouldn't be a bad idea. We'll get a stone cutter's table down here and can we build a toolbox no we can't build a toolbox can we build a toolbox toolbox yes you can build a toolbox okay put that uh i don't know here that seems fine uh we are gonna name this uh the people's coalition no 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 it's it's really more of a uh, like nobility thing so we need to go for like the kingdom of 
evil. <laughs> oh, I can't type. Z evil. <laughs> uh, temple of e evil. <laughs> it's important you get the correct number of e's. Uh, it's part of our branding. Just so you all know. Brilliant, nailed it. Brain power overheat meter. That's a good summary. <laughs> Okay, so we need to really make powering this a bit more of a priority. Can someone just, can you just do that? Just fuel it up and we will queue up cooking meals. Simple, fine meals. We'll do fine meals until we have, and it's nice to have maybe 50. So whoever's set to do that and let's get floors in, shall we? Because wooden floors are just, they're nice for the base to have. That's, what are you? What is, I don't know. There's something happening with the floor there. It's probably the marsh. It's fine. Let's not do the main room, but we'll get wood floor in the bedrooms. People love that. Okay, nice. Yeah, yeah, it's a, it's a big part of our branding uh, and our legal strategy. I am concerned that I haven't built a kill corridor, but I'm still not building it. So <laughs> let's... Uh... Ooh, this is a very wealthy room somehow. <laughs> Somewhat rich. Nice. Okay, uh, make stone blocks. Do we want to pick a type of stone? I don't think there's a lot of marble here. There's granite. Granite, granite, granite. Okay, we'll use granite. Granite accidents. It's on brand. Granite blocks. So we have like a... Oh, not that many. This is... Okay, fine. 2,000. Good luck. <laughs> Go for it. It's gonna be fine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Correct capitalization. It should have been in all caps. The word evil should have been in all caps. That, oh, you're so right. You're so right. Can I change that? Is it too late? Ooh, stats. Nice. What's this? Our friends. Okay. Don't need that. That's fine. And now we're chilling. And everything's fine. I feel like I need to be queuing up more things because they've kind of done all the things that I asked them to. Uh, how are we doing with growth? We've still got a ways to go. So let's do some, get you trained in everything and we'll do some hunting. Uh, what's that in my storage room? I've got li a thing. It's a, it's a memorial of ancient events, which was here when I moved in. Uh, and this is a marble column. Oh, rename colony mod. You know what? It's fine. We'll we'll get past it. I was gonna do something. I forgot what it was. Oh, uh, it's fine. Um, I've got the architect thing open, like I was gonna do something. Clearly not. We could make a little recreation room here. We'll put a chess table and some dining chairs. Pop them here. That'll be nice. And let's get a lamp in here for the work speed. That's important. Should we get the same? Yeah, we should get the same over there. Which means we need to run cables. Uh oh. That's fine. They can all be inside walls for safety. <laughs> Floors, uh, misc. Don't need that yet. Yeah, we can build these these memorial things. This one is a large one. It's of a different design to the one we make, so that's fun. It's a nice little monument in our main room. Barricade. Uh, so it's a... Oh, that's nice. Ah, a raid. Fortunately, the first raid is probably rubbish. I hope you get eaten by elephants. I know elephants don't eat people, but I hope they do it anyway. 
before you get over here. Do I want you? That's a question. Yes, I do. So if we can capture this budding artist, that would be ideal. I think we just continue our work day for now though. Oh, maybe I don't want you two that far away. You're both coming back to the base, that's fine. I just want to keep you near the base. So, oh, I can restrict you to home. So that when this happens, you can all be assembled. I don't know what you're going to do, uh, Heyman, but uh, you're going to be there for moral support. And stabbing. And moral support. Get you set up like this. Unfortunately, Dorkling doesn't seem to have... Oh, you have stun. Nice! Okay, we're going to use stun. We're going to use your psychic powers. If they if they don't die before they get here. Um, which could happen. Let's just reform our formation. Oh, not like that, because you're going to shoot Dorkling in the back, and I know you are. Okay, Dorkling, stun this person. Nice! <laughs> yes! <laughs> He's still going though. <laughs> that that only helped so much. Stun again! Good horse! What are you made of? You're so shot! You're so injured. Okay, there we go. Right, we're capturing this man. I know, that's a really nice potential colonist. I would like them. I'm going to put them in, I guess, this room? Why not? Uh, so furniture, sleeping spot here, and we'll make that for prisoners. He can play chess while he's here, that's fine. Uh, uh, get this mode off and then capture. And we will take your stick, <laughs> sir. <laughs> Colonist or hat, it's, it's a tough call, isn't it? <laughs> Okay, heat wave. Interesting. It's cooler in here. We need to be aiming for a much lower temperature. And then at least they'll have somewhere to recover from the heat wave, so that's good. Let's get a wooden br a bridge for this bit. Harvest his skin! Oh, you know what? If only, if only Seraphix, you could be beautiful. But it's okay, because Dorkling doesn't judge you. Dorkling does not judge you by your appearance. Fun fact. Okay, everyone is probably wanting tables. So let's build a nice big table so they can all eat together with some dining chairs. Do we need this many? No. <laughs> no, we don't. But it looks nice, doesn't it? It looks great. Okay, uh, you're allowed herbal medicine. That's probably about right. How are you doing? You're not gonna die, so that's good. You've been bruised by a horse, you got shot a lot by everyone involved, and the stun because this, this guy took so many hits. The stun was actually amazing from Dorkling. What's going on? Good question. Need to build passive or electric coolers quickly. 36 degrees outdoors. Yeah, that's quite warm. Temperature. Maybe because we don't need it long term, maybe we just chuck some passive coolers in the corners of rooms and like let that happen. That seems fine. Let's chop lots of trees. Because we need to. And do we want to grow more plants? Maybe we want to grow more plants. We don't have a lot of food left. It's not a crisis yet, but it could become a crisis. Let's hunt. Oh, I like the alpacas and I want to tame them. However, for food reasons, we are going to be eating them. It's a shame. It's a shame. <laughs> I would rather... Uh, I would rather tame the alpacas because they're cute and they're good old pack animals soon. We'll get there. We'll get there. Don't worry. Have faith in me. So we've got this nice stockpile. We are low on food. That is true. Thank you, game. Everyone's working hard, though, and we've got a harvest happening. 
and Seraphix has heat stroke. Well, I tried. Vaguely. I vaguely tried. Uh, why don't you prioritize building... Okay, we need more wood. Right. You know what? You prioritize whatever you're going to prioritize. It's fine. <laughs> the coolers will happen and Seraphix, you can just sleep in the fridge. You know what? Just go stand in the fridge. Stand in the fridge, Seraphix, until you feel better. Do you feel better? Three, two, one. Okay, good. Off you go. You're fine. I fixed it. You are dead posh. You're dead posh, but dead basic at the same time. I made your bedroom too nice, really. With this No pot plant. <laughs> you shouldn't be having a pot plant. But I built it. I regret it. Ah, these are not terrible bedrooms, I guess. <laughs> yeah. And now they can eat with table, so that's good. Oh, Dockling, you're inspired at recruitment. So when you next try to recruit a prisoner, you'll instantly succeed. <gasps> nice. Dockling, Dockling, do the recruitment. Do it. What? I thought you were supposed to... You've got inspired recruitment, Dockling. <laughs> okay, you know what? It'll happen at some point. Let's make sure no one else is assigned to it. Warden. Only Dorkling. And you'll do the recruitment and it'll happen. It'll be amazing. I have a sore throat. I need to drink tea. But you want a terrible bedroom. I know. I'm sorry. Oh dear. <laughs> Becoming a colonist didn't work out well for this person. Uh, this is not for prisoners. It's just for medical. Now, put the prisoner in... Not the prisoner. He's a member. He's a valued member of this colony. We're going to need to make clothes for him. We're going to need all sorts. Let's just extend these. And deconstruct these. Okay, that'll happen. Cool. Cool. Do we have any coolers? We've started one. Oh, this is not what I really want you to be prioritizing right now, but <laughs> maybe I should stop queuing up other things. Uh, right, so we need you, clothes, clothes are good. So let's get production and we will get electric tailoring because we have electricity, because we're pretty civilized like that. And I don't really know where to put that, we'll put that here. Can we move this? Yeah, we'll move this over here. And then we'll have space. And then we'll build this to be not there. He here? No. Cancel. Build a copy. Here. Cancel. Perfect. Everything's fine. Except this guy's health. <laughs> oh, he has serious heat strike. Okay, what we're gonna do is we're gonna put the bed in the fridge. And we're gonna remove that bed. And then we're gonna rescue. Get in the fridge, sir. Who's a major break risk? He can't even walk. I'm not worried about him. There we go. He's getting better. People are managing their heat. A hat in the making. <laughs> he could still die, but we used your inspiration, Dorkling, and I didn't think we were going to be able to, so I'm glad. You're not feeling great, are you? But you're a great colonist. I'm really glad to have you here. Oh, we need to name you. Okay, let's see who last spoke in chat that isn't 
Alexi. Okay, Alexi. I need to. Once I find the naming bit, <laughs> you're in. There we go. Alexi. Oh dear, people are eating raw rice. We need cooking to be a higher priority. Seraphix is supposed to be cooking. So what else is Seraphix doing? Uh, I mean, cooking is, because it's left to right, cooking should be a priority. I think it's maybe just not happening fast enough. Oh, maybe we don't have the ingredients. Right, yeah, 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 yeah. Because we need to hunt for it. So we need to hunt and then we need to butcher and then, so let's add simple meals. Just not that many. Just like maybe 20. As, a, as like a backup thing. No one likes Seraphix. You like Seraphix, Dorkling, I think. Do you like Seraphix? You are, you love Seraphix. And Heymon. You love everyone. Okay, Alexi doesn't like Seraphix. And Heymon doesn't like Seraphix. But you like Seraphix, Dorkling. Because you don't care about people's appearances. You're above that. You're better than that. This is the best place for a medical bed to be. <laughs> In the whole place, this is the best for the medical bed. Can someone please... Seraphix, you need wood to do things. Okay, fine. Uh, we gotta order the chopping of the trees. Trees must be chopped. Okay, Seraphix, you gotta chop some trees. <laughs> doing the I can't believe you said you were idle failed to romance you oh dear we're getting food poisoning I always have food problems at the start of this game can you butcher butcher do that oh gosh we really need to fuel this generator okay I'll just do this manually Oh, it's because you're all restricted to home. Duh. Okay, cut this tree. <laughs> Refuel the generator. Cook food. There we go. Okay, we're doing it. It's happening. You're so humble. You're such a humble noble. Your psychic powers are amazing. I didn't know nobility gave you the power to, like, do whatever wacky things you've been doing. Fire! How? Is it just, it's, oh, it's a zizzit. It's a zizzit. No, not the zizzit. <laughs> okay, that's fine. Just so. Oh. Right. Ready. Oh, I might not manage a super late stream because my voice is slowly dying. <laughs> ah, you've gone berserk because of your intense pain. If you just keep wandering that way though, I fully support that. Oh, you were defeated by a cassowary. And are now in need of rescue. Well, I guess we'll rescue you, begrudgingly. The cassowary has gone to sleep. I appreciate your enthusiasm. Seraphix has gone on a food binge. Unfortunately for Seraphix, we don't actually have that much food. Oh, did you abandon? Oh, okay. Alexi's injured. Dorkling! Dorkling! You need to do a rescue. Everyone's useless. 
Thank you. Right. Seraphic's on a mission there, eating all our nice food. That's fine. We're fine for food. Yeah, no one's dead yet, but everyone's breaking emotionally. I don't understand, they have a table. That's like my whole colonist mood management right there is giving people tables. Seraphix, how long does this last? Okay, medical emergency. Our doctor is Seraphix, who is very busy. So, Dorkling. Good luck. Uh, try and save, save him. Or at least get the death up to like enough hours. Yeah, there we go. That's good. That's good. You, you're getting the best medical care possible. Don't worry. <laughs> I forgot about that. Okay, you shouldn't have said at least the colonists aren't dying yet. This is making things a little more dangerous, I reckon. I'm looking forward to you being better, Alexi, so you can be involved. You know what? You're kind of fine. Oh, we'll wait till you're fully better. It seems prudent. I'm gonna increase this to 50 because that's how many I want of meals. I think that's sensible. It's a turtle, a tortoise. A t -t 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 they have a fight back chance? Okay. I thought that would be easy pickings and it probably is, but I don't wanna risk it. Fix your broken heart. You've been heartbroken. Oh, you're fine. You did insult Seraphix, which isn't helping. It's okay. You're one of us now. You're a major break risk. Because you're hungry. Then get go eat food. You can just eat food. You can do that. You don't have to be on bed rest. Okay. You're nearly better, right? Uh, how long until it gets better? Oh, 0 0.8, 0 0.7. Okay, so you're nearly better. Seraphix is better. Everything's fine. Total ate our rice. You know what? We could do some hunting and things like that. It seems a little excessive, but we could. Alexi is up and about doing plant things. Fabulous. Are you going to eat raw rice? Oh no, you're taking the rice. That's good. We really need the wood generator. Dorkling, do you do plant cutting? No. Seraphix, do you do plant cutting? Seraphix! Cut the plant. But did that. Stop shooting at whatever you're shooting at. I get it. You're excited. <laughs> it's fine. But I need you to cook. Oh, you can make them in batches now? That's amazing. What's this? Look, 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 look! Batches! Amazing! We don't need someone to dedicate their whole life to cooking anymore. Fabulous. I love it. Beautiful. We've still got the heat wave, but as long as we keep, like, we give people a space where they can recover, it should be okay. Hopefully. I say this with great optimism, though. So you're making four at once. What's your skill? Is that a skill thing? Cooking. No, you're, you're great, though. Look at those stats. You're brilliant. Okay, life is good. I'm feeling relaxed. Starvation. Oh, Seraphix, you were so busy. <laughs> you were so busy cooking, you didn't get to eat. That's okay, I'll clear that as prioritized. I assume you'll get around to it and it'll be fine. Okay. 
This guy's recovering. Oh, amazing. Amazing! I've survived for, like, I don't know, an hour? An hour! Incredible. Incredible. And everyone is fully healed. Let's take a look at the world. Oh, you gotta have a title to trade there. Okay, that's fine. Uh, another cooler at least. Well, it'll be fine when we don't have a heat wave. We need a more consistent power supply, that's what we need. There's no work being done on research. Uh, because everyone's busy. Okay, well, you know what? I'm gonna uh, suspend this because that's taking up a lot of time and it isn't needed at the moment. Thank you, thank you. I'm really proud. Merciless. Can you change the difficulty? Is that something we should do? I don't know. Storyteller settings. Maybe we, we upgrade it to rough. <laughs> Things are going well. Let's make them a little bit trickier. Not merciless, but a little bit more. Oh, a little chinchilla. Good butcher. So sad. Seraphix letting out some frustration on the local wildlife. Brilliant work. Yep, 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 yep. <laughs> It's a good thing you get this chance to practice your shooting as well. It's important to have hunting as part of our food source because everyone involved needs the shooting practice a lot. Oh, you were sweaty, so now you're sad wondering. We need to get this man some clothes. Duckling, why are you so slow? Because of your major food poisoning. I see. Well, you know what? That's fair enough. Food! <laughs> it's far away food, but it's food nonetheless. And since the horse can haul, maybe the horse will bring it back? Good night. Thank you for joining my stream. It will not be a terribly long stream, and it should all be automatically on YouTube afterwards. Emphasis on should. Okay, we need to fuel this. Need wood. Need to cut this. Okay, someone else needs to fuel this. It's important. A war merchant! Ooh. War merchant, that's a very exciting concept. Welcome. Uh, okay, Dorkling, your time to shine. We're gonna we're gonna do trade. You're gonna meet them, and you're gonna trade with them. Oh, can't talk properly because of poor health. Dorkling, this is a really disappointing first trade. Okay, they have wolves, which is like nice, but I don't think we have the food. Herbal medicine, we can make that pretty easily. We'll sell this club. Uh. War stuff. Okay, maybe we buy an outfit. These are pretty expensive, but uh, it would be nice to have them. Let's get a bearskin parka. Just so we have some clothes <laughs> for our poor naked colonist. Can we tame a monkey? It's not very uh, humble of you. Uh, yeah, I, I put off doing the. Um... Once you're done, sad wondering, we've got a Parker for you. Okay, well you'll finish sad wondering eventually. Maybe we'll have a bedroom for you by then. Oh, you're getting food. Oh, that's so good. Do they eat now while they sad wonder? Amazing. Oh dear. 
I don't even know if there are monkeys here. Are there monkeys here? Maybe there are. Maybe there are. Okay, um, I've decided that the heat wave's over. I don't think the heat wave's over, but I've just declared that it's over. So that's kind of the same, actually. Floors, traps, furniture, ship, structure. Okay, everything's fine. We're doing stuff. We're making food. We have food. We just need to cook it. Cooking is now a much faster process, which is nice. Very nice. We have leather, so we will be able to make clothes. It was pretty expensive to buy the clothes for Alexi, but I think it's worth doing. I'm going to force you to wear that. Get up and get some clothes. And then you can go back to bed. Go! <laughs> Faster! <laughs> I shouldn't have done that. Okay, psychic drone. That's what I needed. Alexi's a bit of a break risk. But you're not naked now. Okay, you've got a lot going on. But I'm just going to leave you. You're going to sort yourself out and you're going to be fine. And we're going to get you a better bedroom real soon. Can't even make it to the table. The table's too far away. <laughs> oh dear. Everyone's got food poisoning. I thought Seraphix was supposed to be a competent chef, but apparently all the vomit in the food preparation area is making that difficult. Oh, Alexi's throwing up too much to eat food. Well, I think I found the cause of our food poisoning problem. Jeez. Right, let's finish architecting out these bedrooms. We might as well do two with dresser and dresser and plants exciting beautiful inspiring okay Everyone's so slow when they've got food poisoning. <laughs> Darkling, you just threw up on that. Don't eat it. I saw you. I watched you throw up on that. Do not... No. <laughs> oh, dear. Oh, dear, Darkling. I know you don't like the fancy life, but... You could... You could at least... Try, you know? Not make yourself sick. There's, there's a line. There's a line that needs to be crossed. Okay, so we're gonna need to do... Numeric priorities. These should always be one. Uh, bed rest should be a priority, so this needs priority one. Uh, two is fine. Warden, not for you. Priority for Dorkling. Handling. Seraphix can do the handling. Cooking is important. These things are less important. We won't do growing for you, but I'm gonna put uh, on a four plant cutting because if anyone's not doing anything, then they might as well be cutting down trees. And I'm gonna make, someone needs to prioritize cleaning. It might be you. You might be the cleaning hauling person because someone has to be. <laughs> Uh, okay. That seems a little better. Dorkling is so weird. Not as weird as your face, Seraphix. Cargo pods. The game is taking pity on me. Thank you, game. <laughs> I need to be pitied, to be honest. It's not going terribly well. It's, it's going fine. Minor break risk. What's the problem? It's just like life sucks a little bit and we still haven't built the passive coolers. I get you. I get you. Let's, uh, temperature wise, I'm going to build another one of these coolers. Because, uh, turns out the heat wave is still happening. Talking, you're so slow. I'm sorry. <laughs> I feel like I should have a cut through here. Let's do that. Let's 
put a door here. I think it would save a lot of walking. Uh, you are, you've still got food poisoning. It's not going great for you, but you've got your psychic ampl amplifier and the pain is making you real sharp. You could zap so many tortoises if you wanted to. Oh, okay. I will just always need two of these then. Which is fine. That makes sense. Let's do... I think we need a few components. So we'll grab a few components. Do we have steel? Okay, we'll do a little bit of steel mining. I don't want to designate too much mining. And then not get other things done that are more important. Dirty cooking area. Good. Well, him and here sh should be doing a lot more hauling and cleaning. So, I'm optimistic. This is the cooling cooler season. Uh-oh. You know what? We're not going to bother with these passive coolers. We're going to build something a little more hardcore, I think. <laughs> what kind of dwarf am I? I'm not anymore. I'm playing Rimworld. I think you'll find. It's not Dwarf Fortress. And even in Dwarf Fortress, I would argue that alcohol is more important than mining. Oh, as in less warm. Okay. That's, uh, that, yeah, thank you. Everything is Dwarf Fortress. Everything is always Dwarf Fortress. Thank you. Welcome! Welcome to the stream. We're streaming. Oh, gosh. We don't know, I don't know how much longer we're streaming for, but we're streaming. I'm struggling. Oh, dear. But things are going all right in RimWorld. And we've got one title for Dork Lane. And you, you hate your hideous environment, but you're doing research. Ah, oh, Psychic Soothe! We upped the difficulty and the game's just been nothing but nice to us. Which means that horrible things are coming. Very, very soon. Okay, we've cleaned up some of the vomit, but we haven't cleaned up the vomit in the food preparation area, which does concern me a little bit. You've never seen so much vomit before. Well, that's because you haven't seen my other playthroughs of RimWorld, clearly. This is a standard amount of vomit. Standard issue. Quest available! Harrowing structure. Build a monument to insult the opinions of his rival. And we get... Uh, Hyperweave. I don't really want Hyperweave. And it's not really worth... So I, I have to use a build a monument with... Uh, like a total resource value of $61 and I get this thing made with value $9. How about no? I forbid anyone to clean it. No, Dorkling, don't do it. You're using your powers for evil. Seraphix doing a little late night cooking. Fortunately, yeah, prioritizing the nice meals. Oh, yeah, a little bit of... Yeah, that's fine. A little bit of vomit there. Don't worry about it. Go to bed. <laughs> Speaking of going to bed... Uh, I'm sorry. I thought this was going to be a longer stream, but I'm I'm struggling a little bit. I've got a... a my voice is going... I think maybe we should end it before it goes too wrong. But don't you keep the monument? Well, too late. I've said no to it. <laughs> Too late. What do I want a monument for as well? I've got a monument. I found this. This is mine. I found it. Ha. Uh, so, I'm going to end this stream here. I'm sorry it wasn't a long stream. I will try to stream more in the future. But, uh, yes. <laughs> I'm not entirely well today. And I feel it. it's affecting the strange ramblings that I'm doing. So, oh, it's valuable. Well, I should have done that. Next time, we will do that. I'm in Civilian, and I'm ending my stream abruptly because, yeah. Anyway, thanks for joining me. I'll do I'll do this again. We'll come back. We'll do it again. Promise. Bye.